All right, guys. Uh, today is the NSAS protest, and guess what? Um, NSAS protesters have just surprised the police as sea of NSAS protesters have been seen heading toward the Lekito gate. And as I speak to you right now, they have overwhelmed the police at the Lekito gate. We are going to bring you more details of this. This is a well organized protest. In fact, from the look of things, this may even be more than last year's protest because these guys are heading on Hillock's jeep on on, uh, on buses, you know, and so they are now relenting despite the fact that the police issued a warning that they are not going to allow the protest, but these NSAS protesters have stormed the street of Lagos and then they are, they've headed. This is the Lekki Tollgate as we speak right now. So the police I've been overwhelmed. As I speak to you right now, they can't even arrest again. They can't even arrest again. I'm going to show you a video clip where the police is trying to negotiate with the NSAS protester. Just wait. I'm going to show you that video clip. But this one is in part. This one is showing you the moment the NSAS protester storm the Lekki Toll Gate. Most of them have been arrested who came much earlier. But I tell you, this is a sea of protests. You can see that's a bus. That's a bus loaded with NSAS protesters. These guys are not backing down. They are coming from all around Lagos. You know, you see, the police have not learned a thing or two. They've not learned anything. They saw what happened to them last year, how they were violent. In fact, how the hunter became the hunted. You see, they thought they could hijack the NSAS protesters and use the, um, use the, the hoodlums against the NSAS. But at the end, the hoodlum turned against the government and start burning down government institutions. They saw what happened. Lagos State lost more than a trillion thousand, I mean, a trillion naira. You know, Lagos is the cost of, you know, repairing Lagos, as was estimated, is up to one trillion naira. So, but the best thing, why is it that, why is it that government will not allow people to, their fundamental human right to protest? Why would they not allow people's fundamental human rights? they have to protest. What are these guys are not armed in any way? They are not armed. They are not even with any stick. Nothing. Only just with Nigerian flag, which is sure they believe in the country. So what do you guys think? Drop your comment and stay put for more updates.